Hello guys, welcome to Night 7 for Exotics. You're in front of the treat. Today we got invited in Al Hazm by Elite Supercar Club. If you know the car scene in Qatar, supercars, hypercars, you name them, luxury cars, you should have known and heard about Elite Supercar Club. Link in the description and follow them. These guys have the most exquisite exotic cars you can ever imagine. And some of them actually travel around the world to the UK, to the US, even to Paris to showcase their cars there to you, the followers. Anyways, they are here. They invited us because, uh, well, actually they are here for the Zuhur. And the Zuhur is basically the dinner before fasting in the holy month of Ramadan. We're not going to talk about these cars in details, but we're going to show you some of the cars that came for the event. And it's not all of them. Keep that in your mind. This is just a small part of them. And then come, let's start. First of all, we have this beautiful 964. And one thing about this car, this car has an immaculate interior. Uh, it's something amazing. The owner of the car loves white with those shapes. And by all means, regardless of the fact that the car is immaculate and a pump, check the number plate. I mean, 964, and this digit is basically the year of birth. I think so. Uh, let's go to the other side. I mean, feast your eyes on this, an STO. And believe it or not, Qatar has, in the GCC countries, the most amount of STOs ever sold in the GCC countries. And this car belongs to a dear friend of ours, Al Umadi. Mohammed, God bless you. I mean, this car is just immaculate. And I mean, this car. You might love it, you might hate it. The rims are custom paint. The 22 is to celebrate the 2022 uh, World Cup. And this car belongs to our dear friend, Lasmach. And I mean, this A12 is just immaculate. And hopefully we're gonna be able to showcase some of these cars for you on private. Let's go to the other side. I mean, by all means, you have luxury SUVs, yes, but also you have this car that came straight from Oman with a special number plate. I mean, these cars, these are yachts on the road. I mean, this is perfection, literally perfection. I mean, feast your eyes on this, an A12 super fast with a special color. I mean, you know, guys in Qatar, when they spec their cars, they spec it into perfection. Even the inside, I mean, we cannot give it justice, but it's kind of bluish with white. It complements the car more, especially with this logo that is in yellow. Let's go to Fadi's car. Fadi is one of my best friends and Fadi has this amazing, actually, I'm thinking about buying this car from him. <laughs> no, that's a joke. He will never sell it. This Ford 88, I mean, it's just immaculate. He bought the car for a fair price and he loves it to death. Almost daily drives it. <laughs> Feast your eyes on this beauty. This SV is actually one of the sexiest SVs that we have in Qatar based on the color. I mean, it's just so boldy for a guy to choose this color to put in a car. It's just, I mean, it's just crazy, right? And then again, an STO. I mean, look, STOs as far as supercars royalty, I mean, the color combination, and this guy opted for something. It came with the stickers, but he opted to remove them and to do this perfect PPF on it so he can give the car justice. It's just amazing. I mean, these cars are like, I mean, seeing them in reality is something else. And then, I mean, man, the SVJ. I mean, look at the combination. A dark Nardo gray, black rims, yellow calibers. The SVJ complements the car, the Italian flag. I mean, this is just perfection. And it has small yellow touches on the inside that complements the car to perfection. It's just crazy. And then the Senna. I mean, the Senna, you know, in Qatar we have a couple of Senna's and each and every Senna that we have is special in its own pedigree. When it comes to the color, when it comes to the motif on the car, we have a black one with orange, we have this one, we have a burgundy one, we have a blue one, 
a Pepsi blue one actually. Uh, we have an orange one. We have so many Senna's in Qatar. I mean, people love Senna's in Qatar. And these cars are just, I mean, pure royalty, right? Let's go to Al Khadr's car. Abdel Al Khadr, he's into Porsches. He's a Porsche fanatic, like the owner of the 964, Lahmeen. This, I mean, this touring is so special. I mean, we're gonna try and put all their Instagram pages on this video in the description below. You go and check their Instagrams out, you're gonna be mind boggled. I mean, this is perfection. He chose the specs on this car and it took him some while. For me, it's one of the most sexy touring cars. What? Really? Oh yeah, no, you can see it from here. I heard about that actually. And I saw the post when he posted. I, I, I'm telling you, this guy, when it comes to Porsches, he's a Porsche fanatic. Go check his Instagram page, it's crazy. I mean, last but not least, these four cars. This Huracan, I mean, this is the baby blue. And I mean, look at this. Okay, this is a detail that you cannot see on so many cars. You have these accents in baby blue. You have the caliber in baby blue. Even the inside is baby blue. Mashallah and Majid, they have a special car. Keep it. And if you want to sell it, we're going to buy it for the YouTube channel. And I mean, you know, I know Pam told me about this car, guys, and I didn't believe it. But when I saw it in reality, it's something else. Because this 812, it's a what? It's a GTS, right? And it's one of the fewest cars in Doha, actually, right? I mean, you know, I mean, look at this. I mean, these kind of details, you don't see on other cars, right? I mean... <laughs> 5, 8, 12, 5. This is one thing that I love about Qatar. I mean, okay, what about this? I mean, come on, seriously? You know, this is the best thing about the Qatar society. It's not just looks. And then let's go to the Cullinan. We had actually three colonists here. Some people had to leave, but look at this thing. I mean, this is pure royalty. I mean, I mean, this guy, he loves supercars to a point, and this number plate, it was on so many special cars, and one of them is this. And just to have the baby blue interior on the car, it's just another level of, I mean, that's another level. It's an another level of baller, even with the stripe. And by all means, you know guys that in Rolls Royce, there is only one guy that does the stripe by hand straight. And I, again, last but not least, special thanks to Elite Supercar Club for allowing us to shoot these cars. And I mean, we cannot finish the video we are shoot without showing you this. These cars actually, when it comes to the Californias, these cars, a couple of years ago, or almost like three, four years ago, the prices of these cars, they were so down. Like you, know, you can buy them almost for cheap. Nowadays, because of what happened with the market and there is less cars, less supercars actually, in the world, not even just in Qatar or even the GC countries, these cars, I mean, from plummeted prices to high rise prices, you cannot get these cars now for less than 400,000 carriers. Regardless of the spec, regardless of the year, regardless of the mileage. And these cars are daily driven cars. I mean, I mean, look at the interior for God's sake. I mean, this is, this is immaculate. This is really immaculate. Compliments the car to perfection. MashaAllah, tabarakallah. And that's it. I mean, we wanted to show you all these cars because to get all these cars in one spot, it's just impossible. And we hope that we will get invited to, their, to other events through Elite Super Car Club. Special thanks to the Elite, special thanks to the admins, special thanks to Al Hazm for allowing us to shoot these cars. And by all means, let's give them a mini showcase and head out. Subscribe, share, mention. This YouTube channel is not gonna be possible without you guys. Kindly raise the numbers of views. I mean, without you, it's not gonna be possible. And Upam, 